Hello everyone and welcome to Jump Roman Tech where we specialize in HVAC but do everything DIY and today we got a service call for a water cooled package unit. Alright so I got the power on, everything here is dead. So I'm going to start by checking the inrush for this transformer. And we have voltage okay unless that in our, we have voltage in our primary here's our secondary and we don't have 24 volts we have a bad transformer let's start with replacing that so right here is a 50 VA transformer and our secondary actually has a resettable secondary has a little breaker built inside which is great because it looks like there might be an issue with our secondary it could be a short on that side and that's why it went bad well let's throw this in there and troubleshoot safety first you're always going to want to turn off your power two wires on the primary two on the secondary so this transformer was actually replaced yesterday and I was here to come in to put in the right one because they said the VA was wrong. The old one was 40, this one is 50. So this is the original transformer the customer took out and it says that our primary is 208. Transformer that's in here has a 120 volt primary. So if 208 volts fed this 120 primary, I'm sure that would fry it. Low voltage is here. That looks like that's our problem. This guy put in the wrong transformer. And if I wire this for 120, my new transformer is gonna, probably gonna fry as well. Great. I'm looking at the diagram. We have a 208 volt primary. Jeez. So that's what's going on here. All right, so I mounted the new transformer right here. Our secondary was correct as it was before, but our primary, I was getting 208 volts across that board. So why would I put a 120 volt primary? I wired this for 208, so hit the switch and see what happens fan kicked on we got a green LED so let's see can I get a meter in there right there 208 primary and we got our 24 volts all right Got a fan going, I believe that's the evaporator. Let's throw this thing on cooling and see what happens. All right, we just set the system to cool. All right, compressor is running. That seems to be our problem, this thing was not wired properly. So, from here, I'm gonna put the gauges on the system if we have poor temperatures, but if we got good temperatures, there's no reason to. So I'm gonna check out the system's operation and uh, that's pretty much it. That was the problem. And if anybody found this video interesting or helpful, please drop a like, comment, subscribe. I'll catch you all next time.